Hey guys, we're going to do an install video for the new version of Realm of Thrones, version 4.0, available right now on Nexus Mods and ModDB. If you go to uh, those sites, you'll notice that there's two files you have to download to make Realm of Thrones work now. It'll be a ROT 4.0 Core and a ROT 4.0 Main. You need both of these, download both. ROT Core is just a, uh, is just a coding. It'll be a real quick download. Our uh, ROT 4.0 main is the scenes, all the assets, everything. It's a huge download. Nine, uh, looks like nine gigs. Okay. The first thing you want to do is you want to unzip both of these with 7-zip. And when you do that, you will be getting a ROT 4.0 core folder and a ROT 4.0 main. The next step, the crucial step, you want to go into these folders. Let's first go into this folder. You'll notice there's an ROT core. This is the actual ROT core module. You will take this, copy it, cut it, whatever you want to do, and then you want to paste it into your Banner Lord directory. Your Banner Lord directory will be right here. Now, on my computer, it is under Program Files 86, Steam, Steam Apps, Common, uh, Mountain Blade 2, Banner Lord. Then you want to actually go into the Modules folder. This is your Modules folder. This is where you will be putting uh, the, the four ROT modules, which are these right here. ROT Map, ROT Dragon, ROT Core, ROT Content. Okay, so let's go back and look at the other one. If you go into ROT 4.0 Main, after you've unzipped it with 7-zip, you'll have the other three model, modules. So you got these three modules, and then this one to equal your four modules. Drop those into your... A banner lord modules uh, folder and you should be good to go the only other thing you need is well let's go ahead and look at the uh, look at the load orders okay here it is right here they'll automatically go in order rt core content map dragon they'll automatically we got them set up so they'll automatically uh, be in the right order but you do need harmony you need a new version of Harmony. This is the one I'm using. And you'll need UI Extender X for some of our uh, new uh, new uh, events for the Renly pop-up and all that. You'll need these two. Or Harmony and UI Extender are absolutely necessary. If you want to have all the mod uh, configuration menu options to change, you need uh, Mod MCM also. And Butterlib's always good because it gives you good crash reports. So that's it. That's all you need uh, for the new version of Realm of Thrones. Right there, these four at the top. And then these four right here. Hope you guys enjoy.